Hello, fellow wanderers. I'm Endry, and thank you for joining me as we wander through some more Castlevania Symphony of the Night. Last time, I did not get a chrysogram, which is probably for the best. But we're here in the library, also known as the Wizard of Oz. Well, you know, they're dropping their javelins, so one of them's giving us their stuff. Uh, what's this way? A neutron bomb! And the- oh, the Biddle Air! Kind of a cool weapon. Power increases as you play the game. So the more hours that tick by, the stronger this gets. I think it's one point of attack per hour played, a digital to whatever its base is. As you'll note, I've not been playing this game very long. It's not very strong. I can't remember if it carries over cleared saves. So like if you have a cleared save, you start over if it counts all of the hours in your cleared save. I hate you, Tin Man. But yeah, you can see, they really hurt, so don't underestimate the Tin Man. And I can't even remember what's the end of this. It's even worth it. Uh, there is a boss, I think the Mud Man boss? Oh, you suck. And are very strong to Axis, so that's right. Of course you are. Ugh. Darn it, I thought that was him dying. I forgot they did that. It's been a while since I've had them do that to me. Let's wing flash our way through that. You know, I keep forgetting I have this. Sweet, sweet revenge time. You don't usually have that at this point in exploring around. Because uh, you nor normally Galabos the last thing you kill before you go after good old Drac. But uh, since I've got it, and these guys annoy me. Oh no, there isn't a boss there. I thought, oh, that's right. You could only get the Mudman from the demon we fought earlier or something like that uh, in that area down there. Which means I don't have a complete beast here, I don't think. Cause I don't think I ever killed a Mudman. Uh, watch in exchange for the axe, sure. Nope. What's this way? Was this trip worth it? Starlight. Hmm. Strength is the- oh, okay. That boosts the power of the cross item. Which is already pretty powerful. But, yeah. Not, not overly worried about the cross, as far as all that goes. Well, that finished up the library. Next! Uh, next is walking out of this place. But yeah, I will go back to the normal library at some point, just to uh, get some potions and such, antidotes, things like that. Give the fairy something to do. You know which. Well, 32. You're getting up there. And we're not going to save. No need to. It didn't take that long. And here we go. Hi, Shmoo. One of these days, they're going to drop the Chrysogram. It doesn't usually take that long to get one. What did he drop? Huh, one J. Now I'm just doing it to be mean. <laughs> I don't have to do that. Ah, he dropped his common drop, the ramen. It's just kind of fun. I don't, normally I don't get to fight things that are weak enough for this to actually be an effective item. You can see the damage is really low, but you know, Fast. Well, reasonably fast. Oh, speaking of the weapon they drop. Oh, nope, never mind. That was not the weapon they drop, that was the accessory they drop. Oh, that's not bad if you just want more attack power. Huh. Did not get particularly lucky on any of the drops from these creatures. That's kind of sad.
Let's try that again. There we go. No. I'll take your money. Yeah, but with the Dragon Helm and the Alucard Sword, we make short work of pretty much everything at this point. We actually don't need to be more powerful. Actually, I think when we got the Dragon Helm, that was the final of... Oh, no, I still need the Alucard Armor, that's right. I still haven't found it. I'm not going to use it when I do, but I still haven't found it. Oh, he gives a shuriken. And a shield potion. Oh, boss fight time? Huh. The creature. Um... Well, that was the creature, everybody. Even if I wasn't this high level, that would not have been that hard of a fight. But hey! We got the Tooth of Lad, which is an item we desperately needed. So, the Tooth plus 10 strength. So now we hurt things even more. We've got one more left to find. I believe it's in the Colosseum. Alright, let's head up. We did just kill a boss, so we are going to save. If you can consider that a boss. Yeah, I think we went the wrong way, people. I think I should have gone the other way uh, to fill up the map, despite the fact that the Chrysogam could have dropped. It didn't, though, so... Ah, yes. Paranthropus. Uh, these dropped the Ring of Varda on Game Clear. So if you're looking to farm one, this is probably the best place to do it. It's pretty rare, so... Don't get your hopes up. Uh, the Alucard equipment will help if you're looking for more luck. Or, of course, they put a luck potion right there. Hint. Hint. If Max up, always welcome. We'll go in that door in just a minute. I see Nova Skeletons. Uh, this way is what? some set. Not worth it, but hey, map completion. Goodbye. I did that specifically because I knew there was going to be a miss spot. Oh, the shuttle. Uh, probably would have been good if I gotten it earlier. Hm, cool. Ah, cool. It's a chakram style weapon with the uh, Adoka attack. That's a, I do like that. That there are such a variety of special abilities the weapons have. The weapons, for the most part, besides the basic swords that have no special ability, feel unique and useful, and they have special functions. And everyone can find their favorite that isn't the Chrysogrim that they abuse to just make the game easy. You know. And here we are with a completely useless area. And that fills in most of the map. We'll just head down this direction to fill in this side. No Nova Skeleton. I do not want you hitting me with the Nova Beam. Oh, we missed some spots. Ow! Yeah, as you can see... No, I do not want the Nova Skeleton hitting me with that beam. It hurts! It's a lot. I'm gonna go fill in the map real quick, cause because of course we are. Oh, I didn't grab that high potion before. Well, I'm glad we came back. And the other one's down there. And that means we have to go all the way back down. The elevator doesn't work. Darn it, Jack of Bones! Why didn't you tell me I missed a spot? There. All complete. So, you notice we're getting back towards the uh, clock 
room hallway here. Which is good. I also noticed that my little fairy friend is not doing her job and telling me where secrets are. But I think I might have to stand still a little bit for that. If I get in another place that has a secret I know about, I will see if I can get her to announce it. I make no promises, though. And yes, there are still secrets we have not gotten. Uh, nope, that's not where I want to go. Still a little low. This is where I want to go. Nope, this might actually be the last session. Uh, corpse weeds. Yep, corpse weeds. Which start out as thorn weeds and then turn into corpse weeds. You leave them alone long enough, I guess. And you're dead. Why am I even fighting them? They don't, they're not worth anything. And now we have some Jack of Bones. Die. Oh, it already failed. And now the skeleton, the skulls. Axe versus, oh, nope, I want the watch. I need the watch for the next part. Best not to forget that. Oh, look. We're back here. And I've explored most of this already, so yeah. Uh, we still need to do the Colosseum proper. So we'll do that. I don't need to be in this form the entire time. This place isn't that dangerous. Don't want to fall down there, though. And no. I see you there. We're not playing that game, and I'm not getting the Bible. I don't like the Nova Skeletons, because even at this point, they still really hurt. Yep, here we go. Nope, please die. I'm low on magic, so I need to let that recharge. What's that left? Two areas left? You need to do Ulrox's Laboratory Reverse. Oh, I hear the clocks. Alright! Nope! And I already went in that one, didn't I? I did. <sighs> Rude. Well, just in case you wanted a different special weapon, there's that. Get a heart up. Uh, do I want a different special weapon? Yep, we'll stick with the cross. See how long I can keep that. And life max up. There you go! So, you remember there was one in the other castle as well, uh, closer to the beginning of the game that had all of those tubes in them. So, that's there. Uh, it's there for a reason. Probably has to do with whatever's up there in this particular version, but we're missing something to open that. And now I get to wait, and wait, and wait. Was it seven, little over seven hours played? All right, to reverse Ulrox's lab. We got time. Down we go. Not even any enemies. Kind of sad. By the way, I think if I press up, she'll land on my shoulder. Will she? Or do I should just stand still. No, 
Not gonna land on my shoulder. Oh. I thought she would. Apparently not. Or I might have to be idle a little longer than that. Boy, that doesn't look friendly. And through here. Oh, I forgot to let her. Hi, Cthulhu. I forgot to see if she could find that secret passage. Ghost Dancer. Suck. High Potion. Sword of Hador. I did not mean to use the cross. Sword of Hador. What do you do? Nothing as far as I can tell. Yeah, it's weird that the Alucard equipment... Like, I actually would have preferred if the Alucard equipment wasn't the quote-unquote best equipment in the game. As far as, you know, standard items go. Wow. This guy actually also really hurts. And of course, is a real pain to hit because he's constantly being knocked back. A little more. Come on. Come on. Get, your, get somewhere where I can hit you. Or not. You know what? Now I am going to use the cross on purpose. Okay. Now we need to explore the rest of this little area. Nope. I'm good. Even though I have almost no hearts now. Because, man, that takes a lot. Coliseum? Coliseum. I would rather just exit the Coliseum than enter it from here. So... Yeah. We'll be back after I explore the rest of the lab. Anything over here? All right, a bag of money. Try this way instead. Right, it just looks like the same hallway we were in. Not though. And yeah, I was just hitting him above my head. I don't know how that works either. Cthulhu, don't quit your day job. Your day job being an elder horror of unimaginable chaos and insanity. So don't don't quit that. Uh, warp point. All right, I think that's the last warp point to unlock as well. Or is there one in the Colosseum and I can't remember? Anyway, guild potion, luck potion, mana prism. And this area is significantly more annoying now. Because like I mentioned when he first came here, that uh, those spikes on the ceiling are not just on the ceiling. They're now our floor, and wow, they hurt. I don't remember if the spike breaker armor works on these. I'm curious. Spike breaker, do you work on these? Yes, you do. Now... No! Bad dagger. Whee! Now we're back out here. Uh, hey look, it's a boss! But I did not let show off anything when we fought them the first time. And I don't really intend to let them show off anything now. Yeah, still don't know what they do for an attack. I know they mi fail miserably being alive. And... yeah. Is it right here that there's a passage? What if I unequip you and re-equip you?
We're gone. We're back. Let's go. Let's go. Or maybe there wasn't a secret passage there. And this way leads to a boss fight. Yes. Oh, the mummy! Hi, mummy. Ooh, you hurt. You really hurt. I don't actually know his attacks, so... Well, it doesn't matter. He's dead now. <laughs> Are you... Yeah, and now he blows away as dust. That was probably supposed to be a lot harder. Oh! Rubo Flad. Weird, I hope the Coliseum had the last piece. Not have to go to the Coliseum at all? And of course, last time, of course, we had to get a assist of platforms to get out of here. We fought all rocks, but uh, nope, not this time. It's all rocks' room, right? Not legionnaires. Start max up. All right. Well, I guess we go left and search around, and we're running a little long, but I have to go find a save point at some point here. Pretty sure there's one on the opposite side of this area. We'll take a look. I think there was one up here. Oh, I angered them. Now they're doing things. Yep. All right, so I'm going to save this and uh, tell our paths cross again. Have fun. Be safe, everyone.